Hello, I am Baby Boo Boo. Let's have fun! A continent is a large area of the land on Earth that is joined together. In general it is agreed there are seven continents in the world. Africa, Antarctica, Asia, Europe, North America, Australasia, or Oceania, and South America. Asia is the largest continent on Earth. It is in the Northern Hemisphere. Asia is connected to Europe in the West. Together, Asia and Europe are called Eurasia. Some of the oldest human civilizations began in Asia, such as Sumer, China, and India. Asia was also home to some large empires, such as, the Persian Empire, the Mongol Empire, and the Ming Empire. The Asian continent, is the largest of all continents. Covering about 30% of the world's land area, it has more people, than any other continent, with about 60% of the world's total population. Stretching from the icy Arctic, in the north, to the hot and steamy equatorial lands in the south, Asia contains huge, empty deserts. As well as some of the world's highest mountains and longest rivers. Asia is surrounded by the Mediterranean Sea, the Black Sea, the Arctic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, and the Indian Ocean. It is separated from Europe by the Pontic Mountains and the Turkish Straits. A long, mainly land border in the west separates Europe and Asia. This line runs north-south down the Ural Mountains in Russia, along the Ural River to the Caspian Sea, and through the Caucasus Mountains to the Black Sea. Some European countries are also partly in Asia. About three-quarters of Russia is in Asia, while the rest is in Europe. Small parts of four other Asian countries are in Europe. Kazakhstan, Georgia, Azerbaijan, and Turkey. Also, the Sinai Peninsula of Egypt lies in Western Asia, and the rest of it is in Africa. Africa is the second largest continent in the world. It makes up about a fifth of the world's land. It is surrounded by large areas of water. There are 54 fully recognized and independent countries in Africa, and 14.7%, 1.216 billion, of the world's population lives there. The history of Africa begins from the first modern human beings and leads to its present difficult state as a politically developing continent. Africa's ancient historic period includes the rise of Egyptian civilization. The further development of societies outside the Nile River Valley, and the interaction, between them and civilizations outside of Africa. From north to south, Africa has most types of climate. Africa has a lot of wildlife. There are many types of animals. In particular, it is now the only continent that has many native species of large mammals. Some of them occur in very large numbers. There are antelope, buffalo, zebra, cheetah, elephant, lion, giraffe, rhinoceros, apes, hyena, and a lot more. Over 2,000 types of fish live in African lakes and rivers. People who come from Africa are called Africans. People north of the Sahara are called Magritus, and people on the south are called Sub-Saharans. Languages in Eastern Africa include Swahili, Oromo, and Amharic. Languages in Western Africa include Lingala, Igbo, and Fulani. The most populated country in Africa is Nigeria. North America is a continent in the northern and western hemispheres of Earth. It is to the east of the Pacific Ocean, the west of the Atlantic Ocean, 
the south of the Arctic Ocean, and the north of South America. It is the northern part of the Americas. The southernmost part is Central America. Hundreds of millions of years ago, North America was part of a larger ancient supercontinent, named Laurasia. A few million years ago, a new land bridge arose and connected North America to South America. Beringia connected North America to Siberia a few times, during ice ages in the past 20,000 years. North America has a population of 527 million and is the fourth most populous continent in the world. North America includes these large countries, listed from north to south. Canada, Greenland, ruled by Denmark, a large island also considered part of North America, though politically, it is in Europe. United States of America and Mexico. South America is the continent to the south of North America. These two continents are separated by the Panama Canal. This long continent is, from the Caribbean Sea, almost to Antarctica. It separates the Atlantic on the east, and Pacific Ocean on the west. South America can be divided into four parts. The Caribbean republics include Colombia, Venezuela, Guyana, Suriname, and French Guiana. The Andean republics include Bolivia, Chile, Ecuador, and Peru. The River Plate republics have Uruguay, Paraguay, and Argentina. Brazil, the largest, is almost half of South America. Antarctica is the Earth's southernmost continent. It is on the South Pole. It's almost entirely south of the Antarctic Circle. Around Antarctica is the Southern Ocean. It is the fifth largest continent in area after Asia, Africa, North America, and South America. About 98% of Antarctica is covered by ice. This ice averages at least 1.6 kilometers, 1.0 mile, in thickness. Europe is a continent. It is the western part of Eurasia. It is separated from Asia by the Ural Mountains in Russia and the Bosporus Strait in Turkey. Europe is surrounded by water on three sides. On the west is the Atlantic Ocean. To the north is the Arctic Ocean. The Mediterranean Sea separates southeastern Europe from Africa. There are more than 50 countries in Europe. Most of these countries are members of the European Union. Europe covers about 100,180,000 square kilometers, 3,930,000 square miles. This is 2% of the Earth's surface, 6.8% of its land area. As of 2015, about 740 million people lived in Europe. This was about 11% of the world's population. Europe is a major tourist attraction. People come from all over the world to see its many world heritage sites and other attractions. Oceania is a name used in geography for the region made up of Australia, New Zealand, New Guinea, and several other island nations in the surrounding area. Some people call this part of the world Australasia instead. The widest definition of Oceania includes the entire region between continental Asia and the Americas, including islands in the Pacific Rim such as the Japanese archipelago, Taiwan, and the Aleutian Islands. On the other hand, the Oceania Ecozone includes all of Micronesia, Fiji, and all of Polynesia except New Zealand. Sometimes, People use the term Oceania to include only the Polynesian and Melanesian islands in the Pacific Ocean, as separate from Australasia.